if we can't correct this, uh, this, this infighting at, at this level, none of you are going to get reelected. And it is a matter of trust here. I think each individual board member, regardless of their distrust, has to meet with the superintendent beforehand. We have had those gotcha moments, and those gotcha moments are now on TV. It is not a comfortable situation. It is basically horrifying. It's not a, a gotcha kind of thing. If you're in a, to, if you're in a situation <laughs> where you want to get somebody, if you're in it for the wrong reason. We amend the agenda every meeting. Um, for some things and I think a good portion of the 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 gotcha moments are are because there are so many things that come last minute that you know you, you're just there you're supposed to vote on something and all of a sudden you're getting it as you walk in to sit on the dais lots of times there are statements that are just thrown out as fact when they really don't have any factual basis and I'll start with um, board agendas being provided seven days in advance and all of the information coming forward afterwards um, I never said Secretary. all uh, to say that items are that everything changes between one meeting and the next there's no accuracy to that or if there is please provide me with that so we can see what changes some of the changes for me at the last minute where the packets are all ready at the at the seats for the board members and then the superintendent secretary will come up and put one last thing in there and it's for a contract of an additional contract for her attorney her outside attorney of twenty thousand dollars you can't have a team unless you have trust you have can't have communication unless you have what trust okay and and I'm, I mean both ways on our side and her side both we got to trust one another and we got to work together and that's what have this school system right now torn apart